Hello, my name is Siddle. Welcome to Bloodborne. Now, I've played all the, the main story in streams, which have been super fun, but I wanted to show you guys some of the cut content that a buddy, Kazrim, told me about. Now, I knew about the big snake boss, but I haven't been able to see anything else because I didn't think you could actually load up stuff in the game. But I found out through some internet searching that you can actually load in to certain like chalices to get to certain bosses. So I'll flash up what you need to get onto this one on the screen. But the only problem with these is once you get in, don't have a lot of echoes because you can't get out. There's no lantern, there's no nothing. You just drop in and there's nothing else here. And this little buddy over here is the alternate moon presence. He's uh he's angry. Thanks. I also have no quicksilver bullets, so this is probably gonna be this is probably gonna be a death montage. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh, you are, you are something else. So yeah, this is the alternate moon presence. It's low poly because uh, they never actually, they didn't keep up, you know, because it got cut. Um, but like this whole arena is different. This looks like the Orphan of Causes kind of arena. So maybe it was a, uh, I honestly don't, don't know. It works though. It is a functional boss. It is a very strong functional boss, which I am not happy about. It also hits super goddamn hard. Yeah. Holy shit! <laughs> what hit? This is gonna be rough. This is gonna be a rough time. Oh man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god, that's that's terrible. Bro, I didn't even make it through the goddamn door. What the fuck, man? <laughs> oh my god. Why is this guy so hard? That's a bait. Holy shit, dude. He just claps me. One hit. See, the, the problem with this place is the only way to get out is to run up these invisible stairs, right? And then just fall. For like, a solid minute. It's ridiculous. There we go. Fuck Christ, dude. Fuck. What? Oh my god. Dude, come on. Holy shit. V2 electric boogaloo. God damn. Can I, can I, fucking seriously? Oh my god. I get it, I get it. It's not supposed to be an easy boss. And it's not an easy boss because it's not in the game. You're not even supposed to play this. The FBI, they know. FBI, open up! Fucking Christ, dude, seriously? Fuck, seriously, dude? Oh my God, he was so low, bro. Not cocky. And by that I mean is, fuck, dude. The arm? is like this, right? And it'll phase you th So you're on this side of the arm, it'll phase you through it. And then pull you. So you can't get around it. That's, that's a... Whoops, that's the problem I'm dealing with. Oh shit, yeah, he's gonna kill me on this one. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Big boy. Question mark? Uh oh. Definitely got caught up. Boy, that's a lot of damage. See, if you watch the little tend tendrils, as he goes up and aim for that spot. Perfect. 
pretty easy spot right here. Bam, baby! You know what they call that? That's an uncut boss. Dead. Oh, and it's raining blood. Amazing! I love it. There you go. There you go. That's the the moon presence alternate uh, alternate boss. Pretty easy. Not no not. I mean not super easy. He's a one one hit boss. But I mean, once you kind of develop a system, so the easiest way to do it. When he floats up, you gotta watch because he's got two little tendrils, and you wanna go to the right side of it every time. And when he floats up, right there, every time. Because he has no way of that, that back corner. He can't get it. He can't he can't hurt you. See? Real quick. Uh, how do I get out of here? Guys? Uh guys? Hello? You guys enjoyed this? Hit that like button. Let me know if you guys want me to do more of these because uh, honestly, it was kind of fun. And if there, I think there's one more uncut boss that I can actually play. So if you guys like this, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. See you guys in the next video. Remember, be awesome, and goodbye.